This was an interesting bidding. The advertisement for the camera showed very little detail. One thing it showed was uh, color in the film window. That led me to believe that the camera has uh, film in it. Didn't know if he could close the camera. He didn't close it. Sent it open. There's film in it. See that color in there? That's film. That's film. Let's see. This camera is a Kodak number 2A folding autographic brownie. The lens seems to be behind the iris inside. This is not the type of camera that I would normally purchase. But I did purchase it because it has film in it. But I think I will wind it until it comes up to a number. Uh -huh. I don't know if that's, oh, that's an eight. There's not much point in not opening it. So I, I think I will wind it the rest of the way and then open it. Extremely difficult to turn. Oh. I'm going to have to open it. You slide this thing over. Pull it out. End up. And there's the film. And there's the backing paper. The lower number could possibly be developed into ancient pictures, but it's not rolling up nicely. But I, there, it, it's going. All right. This film is the reason why I bought this camera. That just a little bit of, of the paper backing uh, was ripped here at the end where it doesn't really matter. But I'm going to save it anyway. There must be pictures on this. I'm going to try to develop it. Now, so what I had was this roll of film. So down in the dark room, I unrolled part of it, and you can see that it's 116 film. One one six. It's a very large spool this way. What I did was I cut a little piece of it off. I made a test strip. I dunked it into the developer for two minutes. Then I lowered it some more, two more minutes, lowered it some more, two more minutes, two more minutes, two more, two, four, six, eight. I figured that six minutes would be about right. So I put a, I took the film all the way off of the reel, put the reel away, and I put a clip on the end and I put a clip on the other end and then I developed the film in a tray with the emulsion side down rolling it back and forth like this 1001, 1002, 1003, 1004, 1005 and so on. I might have been counting to 10 at the time but I got the instructions from a book 
written in 1947, and this is the way people did it if they did not have a developing tank. Perhaps you can see there are some very faint images on it. You can see the frames, and I did get some pictures. I got three pictures, and there, there's a couple more on there, but I can't see them. I only used one-tenth of the developer I was supposed to. I made a mistake with the math. And I still got pictures. So it's crazy. So it worked.